Hi guys, this is Ryan Blair from Halo Inc. And today I'm going to be showing you how to assign uh, different pages to different trays in Fiery when printing on the uh, Xerox Versant 180. Uh, so here you can see we've got a calendar already laid out. And we want the cover and the back cover to print on a different stock, obviously from a different tray. Um, so what we are going to do is we're going to click on the sheet that we want. So sheet number one is going to be our cover. You're going to right click, assign media, and then you're going to select whatever tray you wanted to uh, pull from from the paper source. So we're going to go ahead and select tray five. Hit OK. We're going to go all the way down to the bottom, which has our back cover. We're also going to assign that to tray five. Now the inside of the calendar we want to print on a, a lighter stock. Uh, so basically once you save that by clicking the X button, um, it's going to bring you down here. Now what you're going to do is uh, from the help queue, just double click on your job. Under media, select the tray that you would like to pull from. This one's tray six. And you can see that it kept our, um, our adjustments. So it's pulling uh, pages one and two, which is actually just one sheet and pages 27 and 28, which is the, the final sheet from tray five. And now in order to speed up the process of printing so you don't have to wait for the machine to warm up and cool down, what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna make sure that um, even though these aren't the same GSM, you're gonna set them to the same. So what we're gonna do is uh, when you load the paper into the printer, when you're telling it the paper weight, we're gonna say that the, uh, the lighter paper, which is gonna be tray six, is gonna be the same weight as the heavier stock, which is tray five. And that's gonna eliminate the need to warm up and cool down. Um, if you do run into defects, then you might have to dial that back and find a number that's somewhere in the middle. Or if you can wait for the printer to warm up and down, you can set them to whatever paper weight they are supposed to be. Thanks for watching.